Oprah's splashy interview with Prince Harry and Meghan Markle is all anyone has been talking about. We're effectively into the meme stage of this. Lots of great memes out there. Uh, although we're still kind of unsure why this has gotten so much attention. People are really investing a lot of emotional energy in this reality show slash fairy tale gone wrong. And we have to admit we are curious, though, about the attraction to the royals. We fought wars to be free from the monarchy. But there is this obsession with dynasties here in America, the Kennedys, the Bushes, the Clintons, and maybe even the Trumps. Meanwhile, in England, TV personality Piers Morgan was so upset by the interview and the coverage following it that he quit his job at Good Morning Britain. Watch. Has she said anything about you since she cut you off? I don't think she has, but yet you continue to trash her. OK. I'm done with this. No, no, no. Sorry. No. Oh, uh, Sorry. So, do you know what? That's pathetic. You can trash me, maybe not my no, own. No, 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 no. See you I'm, later. I'm being... So Sorry. Can't this do this. Is Let's be honest, British television has always been a little better than American television. I'm kidding, of course. But was it worth it? Why do Americans care so much about the British royal family? Why did Pierce Morgan walk off the set? Let's find out more about this and welcome in our brand power team, media relations expert and founder of Allison May Public Relations, Allison Maloney. Also with us, marketing and branding expert, Dr. John Tantillo, an applied research psychologist. So John maybe can help me out here. Uh, with the psychology associated with this. Uh, also, we're, we're standing by waiting for that news conference still at the White House on immigration. We might have to cut this short to go there. Uh, but, Allison, I'll start with you. Why are people so fascinated with the royal family? Even Donald Trump Jr. made a video <laughs> bashing Meghan Markle for wanting good attention. So why is everyone so invested in this? Yeah, well, we don't have the royal family here in America. As you mentioned, the closest we really had was uh, was the Kennedys. So it's the intrigue. It's wondering. It's the mystery. I mean, just growing up as kids, you read stories about princesses and, and princes and kings and queens. So it's it's the interest of what goes on in there because we don't have that. So we're very fascinated of, of, of these people and the lives they live. It's kind of like a soap opera too, John, right? There's there's love. There's scandal. There's so much going on that you just you, you can't not watch the interviews and see what's going on. You know, I, I got to admit, I have a special place in my heart for Queen Elizabeth, considering everything she's been through, you know, a fascinating story uh, in history. Uh, but, John, the whole royal family is, you know, uh, obsession here in this country. You know, what drives that? Well, I think, uh, number one, since we don't have it here, it's curiosity. And uh, what I would like to say is that this is all about your target market. And a recent poll, what we see is that older folks in Britain are with the royal family and the younger folk are with um, Harry and his wife. And um, what we can uh, take away from all of that is that brands uh, are really all about who you want to attract. And um, I think Harry and his wife, uh, who is a very attractive uh, individual, uh, personality, I should say, um, is um, winning on the young set. Hmm. So. That's I do think it, I it kind of it. It, it, it maybe breaks down by demographics here. But, Allison, when it comes to the free speech thing uh, with Piers Morgan, the U.K. press is reporting that Meghan Markle filed a complaint to ITV against Piers Morgan. Here's what he tweeted. Quote, on Monday, I said I didn't believe Meghan Markle in her Oprah interview. I've had time to reflect on this opinion, and I still don't. If you do, OK, freedom of speech is a hill I am happy to die on. Thanks for all the love and the hate. I'm off to spend more time with my opinions. You know, I think he's right. You know, they have an actual investigation going on to the things he said. There are a lot more, you know, we don't have a First Amendment in the U.K. here. And, and Pierce Morgan, I'm with you. I'm willing to die on uh, the First Amendment hill with him. And that's his really argument here. That's why he cares so much about this, because he's on a talk show. Why can't he express his opinions? Allison? talk show and he gets paid for his opinions. That's his job. I think people forgot about that. And, and this is his right to say what he feels and how he feels. He's said it on multiple topics. This isn't just the royal family and, and people have gone after him for that. But the fact that there's an investigation into what he said, um, free speech, you're right. It doesn't seem to exist for him. John, what do you think about this? I mean, Pierce Morgan taking a stand for free speech. Do you agree with him? Well, I think it's all a matter of the what when I was coming up called the generation gap and the youngins, uh, they feel that uh, um, 
Pierce should, uh, you know, edit his thoughts. And while the older folks like myself, uh, we feel that uh, it's part of the cancel uh, the uh, the cancel culture, which is uh, against free speech. So I think it's really uh, a demographic breakdown. I think it's concerning too, and we're out of time, unfortunately. But it's concerning when you can level these accusations of racism against like a whole kind of group without being super specific, without having the evidence to back it up. I think that's what a lot of people have an issue or take an issue with there: the accusations without real substantive backing that up. And everybody jumps to their corners, respectively, on this side. Anyway, I've been, you know, refer at first repulsed and now somewhat intrigued and fascinated about this whole thing. Uh, Allison, John, thank you guys for your insight. I appreciate that.